Hi, this is Scott Shepard, teacher at Lake Area Tech, and I'm talking a little bit about Aperture 3 and specifically just giving a quick tour of how I organize things uh, in my Aperture library. Uh, since I've started to use Aperture, I've accumulated somewhere around 50,000 pictures, and I, I have them all in my main library. And uh, because it's important to me that I can find things in a hurry, I have an organizational system that works quite well for me. First of all, you're going to notice that over here I have a variety of different kinds of um, things that pictures appear in. I have something that looks like that, which actually is a, called a smart folder. I have something that looks like that that is called a folder. And then inside the folder, I have a variety of um, <laughs> projects, and they look like that. So just real quickly, how does this work? First of all, whenever I import something, I import it into a project. And the project, uh, lately, I've just been creating one project for a year and then putting everything inside of that project. So I have 2010 down here, but then everything in that looks like this. So each one of these is a photo shoot. Um, I put the year and the month and the day at the front because then they get sorted chronologically, which is how I like to look for things. Um, and the only other thing that I would say is that um, I just am experimenting with folders. And if you create a folder and put it at the uh, top level of the hierarchy, and um, if you number it like this, it will show up at the top of the heap, uh, I can then put individual projects inside that. So for example, I have a travel folder, and then I have all of my travel projects here, which are fairly well organized, both by trip and then by place that we visited. And I also have one for portraits. And I'm just now trying to figure out how else I can organize my um, library so they don't have quite so many uh, things in it vertically. But anyway, there are some really good ways to organize things. You have to find a system that works for you, but this for, that works for you, but this seems to work for me. Thanks for listening.